And greetings once again, Primitive Earth Humans. Welcome back to Sky Factory 2.4. So, yes, in the last episode, uh, again, let's put our Zvikio helmet back on. Yes, in our last episode, we uh, were on the moon and uh, we did a little bit of stuff up there um, searching for meteoric iron, this stuff right here. So, I did a little bit of work off camera and, uh, Went flying around, harvested a bunch of this stuff. Um, I also did a few thing, a few extra things up there, which we'll see when we return back to our moon base. I um, went and uh, came back home, and I brought our golden lasso along with us, so I can move those annoying uh, alien villagers the hell out of my place with their ha 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 all the time. <laughs> They're quite annoying, and I put doors on all their uh, little village. Uh, Huts or whatever the hell you call their little moon houses. And, uh, yeah, did that and tried to light up the whole little moon village a little bit more just to, um, keep the monsters out. They still spawn inside, um, the, the fence perimeter. But again, you know, we can fly and we've got our trusty butt blaster armed with our cheek seeking missiles. So we probe them in the bung if they become a problem. But anyway, I don't know, uh, 15 of this meteoric iron if that's going to be enough to really do anything with but let's see let's see what we can do with it we need this stuff for the next tier of things for what to do uh such as uh building our tier 2 rocket i don't think this is going to be enough so i might have to uh um spend a little time up on the moon gathering more of this meteoric iron but uh if we click you in our, uh, let's see, hold on. let's do it this way. If we click the U button while we're on this thing, it will show us the uses. No, we do not want to convert it into throttable meteor chunks. It's kind of a waste of this stuff. It's kind of hard to come by. So we can smelt this up and make a meteoric iron ingots. So, you know, we can double it. You know, we can throw it in our smelter here. And I think we'll get to double the uh, ingots out of it. So, you know, so we'll get to, you know, about 30 ingots. Once it's all done, let's see. Oh, we had a couple in there as well. So, you know, we'll get 32, maybe 32 ingots, 34 perhaps. And, of course, what we're going to want to do with it is grab this out of there and toss that in as well. What we're going to want to do with this stuff is, uh, Let's see. Let's grab it up. And, um, <laughs> you again. We can make, uh, let's see, oh, electric arc furnace. We don't care about that. No, no, no. But we're going to want to make a bunch of this heavy duty plate tier one stuff. Which, uh, oh, no, no, that's not it. The hell, I don't even know what the hell I'm talking about here. But I think, yeah. We slam bang this stuff in the annoying ingot compressor and turn it into a breast meteoric iron. Looks like we get two out of each ingot, so we should get at least a full stack of that stuff. And let's see what the. Uh, eh, will it tell us what other uses are for it? Well, we don't really need that. We can just look at Galactocraft. And just one T. Still getting used to this new keyboard. It's uh, quite clickety. So, do 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 do. Here we go. Compressed meteoric iron. What can we use it for? Okay, it can tell us how to make it. But I think what we need is things like oh, we could just look at the uh, there's the tier one rocket, tier three rocket. What we need. Compressed dash, which I think we've got to go to Mars to get. But, uh, where is the tier 2 rocket? Here's our tier 2 rocket. And yes, heavy duty plate. And that does require the meteoric iron. So, how much of that we're we gonna need? 
really need about 10 pieces of it. I think the rest of this stuff is just the standard heavy duty plate. So we've got more than enough of this stuff to, to do stuff with. So let's uh, throw half of it in this compressor and half of it in this one. And I put away our sound muffler, so it's going to go bang. That horrible, horrible clanging sound, <laughs> which is terribly annoying. But, you know, it's not like we're going to leave this thing running. That much we only got a little bit of this stuff. Grab up what we got here. And another thing we can now craft is the cryogenic chamber, which is a pretty cool little thing. Uh, let me see, is this requiring dash? No, no, it's not. So we should be able to craft on one or two of these, but oh wait, no, we do need compressed dash. And we are going to find that on Mars. So, we're going to have to get our butts to Mars. And is that all of it? A groovy groovy. But uh, we're not quite ready to go to Mars just yet. Um, and while we're home here, Let's check our field over here. We just really haven't seen any uh, fluid cows in such a long time. Um, the occasional cryptors, for which uh, we just probe them in their bottoms. But, uh, okay, so groovy groovy. Come back down, we'll throw this your stuff in there. It will get automatically cooked up. And another problem we have is that now, um, it seems that, uh, since I've upgraded the mod pack, that, uh, what tends to happen now is, uh, these work differently. It seems like it's starting to, to consume the actual, uh, stones here. Um, let's see, where is our weak confusion stone? And it keeps moving the stone out of those auto-crafters. So I'm going to have to look up, um, is it in here? No, 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 where did I put it? Did I put it somewhere? Probably put it somewhere, unless it has disappeared. Well, I don't know. But anyway, these machines now seem to work differently. Um, you used to be able to just put your infusion stone in there, and it would do its thing. Not so anymore, apparently. So, um... Like, for instance, <laughs> once it crafts this uh, pattern here, it not only outputs the uh, Crucio Essence, but it will output the stone again. So, it looks like in order to fix that, and I don't know where my, uh, my weak or basic uh, infusion stone <laughs> just disappeared too. Maybe I'll craft another one. But I'm going to have to uh, get in here, perhaps, and... Uh, Put some filters in here in order to uh, re-enter the uh, stones in there if I want to make some more, you know, of the uh, higher forms of essence here. As you see right now, I've got 140 stacks of just the uh, Minicio or Minicio essence, and uh, you know, not too big a deal, not a huge priority for us right now. Our Zavikio armor, we can repair it with uh, Zavikio essence. But it's holding up pretty damn good, so I am not too concerned about that. But, uh, so I think right now, um, I don't know, we could probably, you know, we could build our Tier 2 rocket and head off to Mars. But, before we do that, we're going to need ourselves, uh, we need to craft up another one of these uh, advanced ender porters. This one now is full. We've got uh, you know, four crystals in it that are all designated to locations. And that's basically our, our moon traveling uh, advanced ender porter there. So we will need to make up a second one. Let's drop these things off. And uh, so why don't we do that now? Uh, do, do, do. Advanced ender porter. We need to make a normal one. Do we have any of this ender alloy? Let's see if we do. Uh, we do. We need to make an ender core. Hello. 
which is uh, this guy here. And I think, uh, let's see, right click an ender crystal to activate in the end. So, yeah, why don't we go ahead and uh, we'll just travel to the end. We don't have to eat our end cake anymore. We can just use our handy dandy ender porter. And like I say, we'll probably make a bunch more of these because uh, eventually I'd like to visit all the planets in that more planets mod. And all of the regular uh, Galactocraft uh, solar system planets as well. So we'll need a bunch of these guys, you know, to get back and forth, so. Did that, uh, oh great, right click to the whole stack and it uh, basically uh, did our whole stack for us there. And why don't we, while we're here, we'll recharge our Ender Capacitor. Put it back in our Ender Porter. Ba ching ching. And we can just back, you know, hump, uh, jump back into, did I say hump? Hump back? We can hump back. <laughs> we can jump back <laughs> to the overworld through the little portal thingy. And not waste the juice in our Ender Porter. So, okay, Griffy Griffy. Let us make another Ender Porter. You know, perhaps it may be a good idea to rename this one. We've got, oh, we've got 52 levels. Um, mm -hmm. You know, I think maybe we don't need to do that because I think it's going to rename the crystal in it. So depending on what we, which crystal we select. So, yeah. No problem. We'll just leave that. We don't need to rename these guys. So, let's see. Oh, is that even the wrong one? <laughs> Reporter. Enhanced. Yeah, okay. Derpage. Can we make the enhanced one? Hmm, let's see if we can make it this way. And, uh, grab up these guys again. Can we put one already in there? Oh, dang. I probably just wasted these by, uh, charging them. Didn't I? Perhaps, let's see. Oh, wait a minute. We've got the wrong recipe here anyway. And what do we need? Oh, we need more Eye of Ender. Of course, that's what we need. Let's, uh, sure, let's make a stack of them. We got plenty of resources. So, let's see. Oh, and we need, uh, um, derpage. Yeah, we need some blocks of emerald. Sure, we'll make six of them. six of these guys, I guess. I guess we can't really make use of these other inner basic ender cores. Uh, we charged them up, but ah, screw it. We make it a mistake sometime. Then we do that. No problem. We shall go back to the end. Swing. And we'll charge these guys up, and, uh, Yes, too, and I also want to give a big uh, welcome and thank you to all the new subscribers. Uh, yeah, I got a really nice uh, shout-out last Sunday from uh, Roshank Redemption's channel. Um, if you haven't checked his, his channel out, uh, definitely do so. Really awesome channel. Extremely awesome. Uman, uh, who gave me a you know, real nice shout-out. He gives a... Uh, Lots of shout-outs, you know, just in order to help a lot of small YouTube channels out there. And he's really given me a great boost. Uh, he was the first Human uh, entity to actually um, comment on one of my videos and uh, said he had a really, you know, great uh, YouTube community. And, you know, I feel like, you know, he invited me to his wonderful community. Really awesome, awesome people. And uh, so I really... You know, a great debt of gratitude to the Roshank Redemption Unit. If you haven't checked his channel out, uh, link in the description. 
Please do so or you will be probed in the bottom. <laughs> Ender Porter, okay. Should be able to make this guy now. Let's make, uh, sure, let's make six of them. Well, they stack now. That's okay. And we have run out of the uh, stuff here under alloy. How much of this can we make? Um, screw it, let's just make it all. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, big thank you to uh, Roshank Redemption and all of the new subscribers. Uh, are we out of Ivander again? Really? Okay, make another stack. And as I mentioned in my last uh, Fallout 3 video, I'm going to be trying to uh, do shorter videos from now on. Uh, you know, more like around 30 minutes or so. I, I normally make videos that are about uh, 45 minutes or something like that. Uh, try to cut them down to about 30 minutes, you know, for daily ups and uploads. You know, I know people have lots of stuff to do and uh, maybe the shorter videos will be more convenient. So let's see, what do we want here? We want advanced ender core. Do, do, do. Yes, the advanced ones. How do I make them? Ah, ooh, 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 ooh. Do we have... No, we don't. Blocks or diamond. So, one, two, three, four, five, six of those guys. And we'll make six of these guys. And back to the end again to uh, charge these bad boys up. So, let's see. Mm hmm. And we are set for the end. Oh, yes, we are. Derpage. And okay, back in the end, we will charge these guys up, all six of them at once, which is most grotesque that we can do that. We will recharge again our ender capacitor. Stick her all back in there. And groovy, groovy. Now we've got uh, six of these ender porters, so we need to craft them into advanced ender porters. Back home through the portal. And back home again. Now let's take these uh, six ender porters and craft them into the advanced variety. Which we should now be able to do. you in there. Ah, oh, there we go. That's what we want. And, of course, we do not need some more of this stuff. And what did we just run out of? Eyeballs of Ender again. <laughs> Boy, okay, let's make two stacks of these. <laughs> I don't know how our blaze powder powder's holding up, but Really, and not too uh, worried about it, because we got ourselves a blaze farm. We'll go get some if we need. And let's see, you get out of there. I want these guys. Oops. And again. More of this stuff. Let's see how much we can do with that now. more of these. Okay. <laughs> we should get it right here. There we go. We'll put these guys in there and are we going to have enough to do... Oh, now what, did, what am I missing? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It keeps switching stuff on me. Stop doing that, you, you dumb thing. Okay, great. Now we got uh, seven of these guys. So great. We've got enough for future traveling. That gives us 28 more locations. Um, 
this one is the one that is already set up so we're gonna need uh, we're gonna need 24 of those crystals and how many do we do we have we've got 12 of them and I think it is it is it's the green crystals I think it is the green crystals yes those are the ones we want so we need another dozen of these green link crystals um, and again I don't know what these blue ones do I wish there was more information on this uh, Ender Utilities mod. But, it is what it is. So, let's see. Basic Ender Alloy, do we have any? No. Do we have any green stained glass? Let's make a stack of those guys and back to this. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Sweet, that's enough. And make what we need. So, let's install these crystals now in these guys. Um, we also need to make do 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 the uh, what you call it the capacitors. So we're gonna need six of those. I think right now we can go ahead and fill these crystals in. Do those one at a time here. And we'll be set for a while with these. I don't know how many more locations we're going to need to uh, visit. But if we need more, we'll make more of these guys. Got plenty of resources for the doing so. And last one there. Groovy groovy. So we've got our six uh, advanced ender porters there we just need the capacitor thing so and of course i want to make the top tier one here so mm -hmm. one two oh, i guess we don't stack these three four five six and uh, again now we go back to the end and we'll charge these guys up so we're still set for the end here, no problem. So convenient traveling around with these things. And okay, here we go. We will click these guys one at a time to charge them up. One last one. And gritty. Now we can install these. Pitching. One at a time. And gritty. Now we got a whole bunch of these, uh, Advanced Ender Porters. I guess this one here will be our main one that gets us back to the end. So at most, you know, if we're going to travel to someplace other than the moon, we would need to carry two of these guys. But again, this is a thing we can just uh, throw in a, our space backpack, which we've got, you know, plenty of space in there. So now, of course, uh, all we have to do with these things is uh, they're already filled up with crystals. So each one of these, again, is going to store four locations. If we shift and right click with it um, on a spot, it will uh, set one of those uh, four crystals in there to that location. So all we got to do is travel to the locations that we want to uh, program into this thing and uh, right click on the spot we want to teleport back to and set those locations. So one of these will probably be for uh, you know Mars and a couple other planets. So yeah, so we've got you know four times uh, six uh, locations that we've got uh, 24 additional locations we can now travel to once we get there with that and this will be our main one for traveling back to the end to recharge these guys and for uh, traveling home and for traveling to the moon so groovy I think that's gonna give us uh, more than enough for a while so cool 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 we've got ourselves uh little bit of meteoric iron 
Well, we got, uh, oh, I guess just a mere 17 of these plates here. Uh, we only need 10 of them for our Tier 2 rocket, so we've got enough of those to make our Tier 2 rocket, I believe. And um, that will get us to Mars, and, uh, and again, uh, one thing of note before you go to Mars, you definitely got to make this thermal padding here. Um, and again, you know, we can look at uh, the recipes for that. It's just this thermal cloth, not a real expensive res recipe. A bunch of wool and some redstone. Make yourself a full set of the thermal padding before you go to Mars because of the heat on that planet will kill the uh, crap out of you. And we don't want that, so I think in the next episode, uh, we will go ahead and uh, use our handy dandy NASA workbench, craft our tier 2 rocket, in fact. We've got the recipe now. We got a couple of them. We did uh, two dungeon bosses. So let's uh, go ahead and install that into, let's see, where do we install it at uh, next? Unlock schematic. Pachin. And back. And now we've got tier 2 rocket schematic. So I'm surprised we, you know, got two of those instead of we did not get the moon buggy schematic. I don't know if now if that's a, a thing you find on Mars. But we are dead. Uh, chest remain open. <laughs> but uh, maybe, um, Maybe I'll take a, take a look around the moon and see if I can find a third moon dungeon and kill the uh, skeleton boss there and see if we can get a moon buggy schematic. Uh, I'm not going to build the moon buggy anyway, because really, who needs it? We've got Zabikio armor, we can fly, and we've got our backpacks for storing stuff, so no real reason to uh, waste resources on a moon buggy, as uh, we can travel much quicker through the power of light. So, anyway, that should do it for this episode. Uh, the next one, we will build our Tier 2 rocket and possibly travel to Mars and uh, use one of our advanced enderporters to uh, set our locations there. Then we can start building a base there and gathering resources and start getting some of that dash stuff that we need to continue uh, leveling up in the rocket tiers and all the other grivy stuff we can do with Galactocraft. So... That should do it for this episode. If you enjoyed this episode, please do remember to rate, comment, share, and subscribe. And always obey your alien overlords, or you will be probed in the bone. Once again, this is Alien Pet 13 signing off. Probe you later.